Hey guys, welcome to the video. This time we're gonna do a little hotel tour of a hotel here in local to us. It's the Doubletree, Lawrenceburg, Indiana. We got a sweet river view. You can't see it right now because it's dark. So we'll hit that in the morning, but we'll go ahead and take you on a tour right after that intro. Roll that intro. This is a one bedroom suite. It comes with a kitchen at area, it has a table, microwave, sink. The uh, fridge is in right below the coffee station. Then uh, it's got the microwave and some good storage if you're gonna use it for something. Oh, it's got a decent sized table with some chairs. The closet, one closet, look, don't ignore all of our stuff. Ignore all, all of our stuff. So it's a pretty decent size. The couch does pull out into a bed. So that's where Devin's sleeping tonight. <laughs> Got a nice TV, probably 50 inch, I would say. Don't know if we can see anything out the window, but we can sure look. Nope. There's like a little gateway. This goes out to what was a restaurant. Okay, so from in the living room, we'll go this way. This is the bedroom. You can either get these rooms with two queen or one king. It's got a small TV. As with every hotel room nowadays, they're doing this, um, you know, protected <laughs> or cleaned in a baggy thing. It's got a nice little desk. Um, but what I like, it's got um, dual climate. So it's like in here you can control your climate and out in the other room you can control your climate. So the bed is really comfy, I can say from experience. And then the other interesting thing is this has like a split bathroom. So this side has the shower and a sink area. There's no toilet in this side. And then there's like a door right here. And you go through the door, you see me, A. And this is like a sink area. And then the toilet's over here. So it's kind of like one bathroom. It would be nice if it had like two toilets. And then also inside the this room where the bed is, there's not really storage. There's drawers, that's what you have, so. It's not too bad, but if you're staying for a long period of time and you, you have want to hang things up, you have to do it out here. It's kind of a quick little room tour. Well, me and Devin will take you on a hotel tour in the morning. When it's daylight, we can see things outside. Then we have another surprise. We'll be showing you another room type. So stick around for that in a second. down to the elevator. They do have fending on each floor, which is not common in a lot of hotels nowadays. Most of the time they have the uh, marketplace only. They also have hand sanitizer at the elevator. They have this uh, nice wreath here at the bottom of the elevator, some stairs. They have a levee bar and grill, some Starbucks coffee. This is like the breakfast area. During non-Rona times, you'll have like a buffet thing set up here. Right. There's like a, See you, Laura. the levee bar. Obviously, this is the morning time, so it's not open yet, but want to catch a drink or something? Come down here. This is the main lobby. They have like a little internet station over here. Of course, it's Christmas time currently, so they have the police head again. Christmas tree. Check in elevators. That way is the convention, convention center which isn't currently operating in 2020. I just want to come out and show you guys outside. It's currently in the morning time, like the levee bar and grill, but this is downtown Lawrenceburg, the parking garage for like Ivy Tech. So they kind of have Ivy Tech colors, lights. They have a sweet Christmas tree, some snowflakes on, I don't know if you could tell these are 
like smokestacks for like a uh, riverboat. You have to park here at the public parking right across the street. This whole building right here, all the way down, is the uh, convention center on that side and the hotels on this side. There's the sign. All right, a couple days later, <laughs> and this isn't the same day, so different shirt, same, same merch shirt though. So uh, link in the description. So this is a standard hotel room at the Doubletree in Lawrenceburg. This is room 902. So let's take a tour of this one. All right, so we'll start in the bathroom. Good sink, lots of storage space on the sink. It's pretty impressive actually. The toilet, this is like a lot of room over here too. This is kind of impressive. Same shower as the um, suite room, except for this one kind of has like, which is nice, it's like it got an extra little wand. That's pretty neat. And come out here, got like nice little seating area, a devin. There's a closet right here. And so this is two queen beds with a pretty decent, like good amount of pillows. They gave us four, so that's pretty good. For each bed. <laughs> and then, of course, the plug situation. They have plugs uh, on the lights, so that's pretty neat. They have a uh, kind of smallish TV in this room. If I'm if I'm being honest, it's uh -huh. this has got to be like a forty inch or something. It's it's not very big. <laughs> not that that's a problem or anything. It's just just weird that you see mostly fifty inch and bigger. They have uh, your coffee maker, nice desk area with a good comfy looking chair. Yeah, so this has the thermostat over there by where Devin is for the, like the other room did. And then same view, although this one you can kind of see, we're like closer to the middle. So you can kind of see like the, almost can see the smokestacks and the clock and the flag. All right, so I hope you like this review of the Doubletree Lawrenceburg, Indiana. I will say it's a nice convenient hotel to have in town. The restaurant downstairs um, is really good. They do have room service, although currently I'm not 100% sure. I didn't see a room service menu, so I'm not sure in the current situation if they do. I will say that the standard room seems pretty nice, but if you need a little extra room to spread out, go for the suite. It's really, like I think the difference in price, well at least current time, was only like 20 bucks for us, so it wasn't that big of a difference. And you can also get the suite rooms with like two queen beds versus one king bed. So you'd have two queens plus the sleeper sofa. So that would be very helpful if you had a bigger family. So what do you think, Devin? Did you like the uh, hotel? Yeah, the hotel is pretty nice. It's pretty convenient and so far it's pretty clean. Yeah, we haven't. We can't speak for these beds per se, but you know, I'm pretty sure if they're anything like the one in the other room, it's going to be good. So. Mm -hmm. All right, so thanks a lot for watching this video. If you'd like to support the channel, you can go ahead and click uh, down the links that are gonna be in the description for our coffee page that just helps us out. It's like a virtual tip jar. We have Patreon as well. That's a monthly like subscription type thing that helps the channel out. Uh, we have merch. Um, the links, actually they're in the little tray below this video if you wanna click on that. All right guys, so we're gonna go ahead and wrap it up here. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and smash that like button. Just, just, or gently tap it, smash, tap, whatever still works. If you're new here, go ahead and subscribe. We make new videos every week. Uh, there's travel content, we do reviews, so some skit stuff, maybe. Anyway, go, go ahead and wrap it up. Thanks a lot for watching. Peace and love.